phones around? Hopefully they'll have some answers at the police station. Wait, you're a cop? Yeah, Leon Kennedy. You are? Claire. Claire Redfield. Claire, are you okay? Yeah, I'm all right. How about you? I can't stay here. It's not safe. Go on ahead. I'll meet you at the station! I'll be there! Okay, that abbreviated intro scene Claire, sets the stage. I hope you made it here. Ooh, a makeshift graveyard. Kind of a bad place to want to be, huh? Wonder how long ago it was that they were actually putting this much effort into burying their dead. Well, anyway. This version of the game, the second story, is actually a little bit shorter. By a little bit, I mean it's actually a significant amount shorter. It's something like... Well, I figured, I've only done this once, and I played as Leon as the A story and Claire as the B story. But I figured it to be about, I don't know, oh, see, there's the main entrance to the police station, we're not going to be going through there. I figured it to be about, uh, like, 75% or so as long. So if it took you, like, eight hours, then it's going to take you six hours to do the B story. Nope, can't do that. I only have five rounds for Matilda. Oh, the helicopter crash. It must have taken him a while to get to the police station because, holy shit, by the time we reached this part with Claire, she had been running around in there for like half an hour. Excuse me for a second. I just realized that I had some options disabled. Um, where is it? Uh, oh, damn it. Where is it? <laughs> the HUD was off. Wanted to get the HUD on. It's hard to play the game with the HUD off. meeting like this. Are you all right? Police chopper, it just came out of nowhere. Yeah, I'm fine. I take it you don't have the key. No, I don't. It's good to see your face, though. How are you holding up? I am hanging in there. Hell of a night, huh? Yeah. Did you find your brother? I did, actually. He's... Just when you think it can't get any worse. Leon, you should get going. Don't worry about me. Just get yourself to safety. No, Leon, seriously, they're getting through the fence. Please, just go. We're gonna make it. Both of us. So 
are going to be a few sort of subtle-ish changes to the game. We have a lot of the same puzzles, but different solutions to the puzzles. And, like, for example, this here, we are starting in a different place, although a number of the early parts of getting through the police station, not going to be an issue. Ooh, an M19. Lots of stuff. Gotta love stuff. Oh, look at that. Ah, so that's how he got geared up. Not exactly how I pictured breaking this in. Alright, so this gun has a little bit more of an oomph to it, and he's holding it sideways gangsta style. <laughs> That's goofy. Fly today to be a member of STARS. Oh, Brad Vickers. <laughs> the helicopter pilot. The wuss, really. Now, I've been thinking about this. When I go through this, because it's... I got the, um, the extra guns here. So I was wondering, thinking about whether I should use them or not. Probably shouldn't. It does sort of take something away from the game, but this is the second playthrough, so it's not like I'm going to not use it for the time being. Is the right way? Yep. Oh, shit. I'll be down. Run, run, run. This is not how I imagined my first day. <laughs> okay, so I don't think we can go this way, can we? Zombie. <laughs> it's a little bit different. I'm not gonna need that cake. Damn it. Damn you. <laughs> I put the, uh, put the bolt cutters away like an idiot. Oh, can't get through there. Ah, that was stupid of me. I gotta go get the bolt cutters, damn it. Plenty of ammo for the uh, this 45. Zombie? Wow. I gotta go back. Well, maybe I can go up. Zombies place a little differently. Just So 
much of the same shit. <laughs> Weapons locker. Keycard got that a lot faster. Alright. Considering the circumstance, I'm gonna get lazy. Oh shit. So that's how I'm going to justify to myself <laughs> doing this. Infinite ammo. Hey, you like me now, bitch? Not even dead yet. It definitely does change the way the game is played. Oh, he's still up. He is still up. I've already killed more zombies in this run than I did on the entirety of the other run. Now, this is actually kind of fun. Oh, no, you don't. What? Same mistake it did before, and not close any of these up. Okay, yeah, I wasn't expecting them to get through here so quickly. Yeah, there's no. I don't want to be cheating so much. Why even bother taking this? Well, I presume at some point I'll stop cheating and I'll go back to trying to play the game a little bit more normally. Oh, there's a fuse. That's how I get out of here. Can I get to the uh, basement already? Now, Claire didn't go through this way to get to the basement. She went through the chief's office to get in and out of the police station in the basement. Now this area did exist in the original game, I remember that. And I think it's both characters, you had to make your way through here to get to the, get to the basement. There wasn't any of that other shit that you had to do. Some coffee. 
Oh, there's my uh, round handle. Man, he's got no inventory space. It's kind of weird going back to not having any inventory space after having it for so long. Just steadily expanding and then you, you more or less start over again and you're not you're not able to carry anything and your weapons kind of suck too. Well, I mean, not this one. I'm cheating my ass off, but... as to what their Hello? intentions were. Is anybody here? Because you definitely have... Oh, there you go. A situation where they were... Oh, there's no item box in here. Something ah. tells me he's not a cop. <laughs> they clearly put a bit of effort into sort of trying to... Oh, sorry, Mark. They put some effort into trying to make a kind... There's the notebook. Have these two different characters move through the police station in a way that makes sense. Because... Like, if you have the A scenario and you have the B scenario, and the B scenario is supposed to be like what happens what in the... after you've played through as the other character what it was like for the other one. Oh, hi. But honestly, I don't think they really did that great of a job. Because you'll notice there are a number of things that really don't make any sense. Like, I don't know. We're going to see the same... We're going to see, like, Marvin there. Well, Claire put Marvin down. Yet Marvin's a zombie here. So Marvin died pretty damn quick. Marvin died quicker in this... In the B scenario than he did in the A scenario. Boy, though, Marvin died so fast. Why did both characters get to kill him? Down at the Son of a bitch. I can both characters got to put him down. What's going on there? Why does the uh we're gonna see that the tyrant is going to play a bigger role in this world too? scenario than it did in Claire's. It doesn't make any sense. Tyrant dies. Well, Tyrant's not going to be dead in this playthrough. So what the hell's going on? Mm -hmm. Doesn't make any sense. Now, you gotta sort of give him a certain amount of leeway. It is just a video game. It's not real life. And it's not a more serious story. Hi. <laughs> And trying to keep all those separate things separate is going to be a little bit difficult. But what I'd wish they had done was instead of trying to focus on each character having an A scenario and each character having a B scenario like there was in the original game, they just had one A and one B. So that way each character can have like the proper kind of... Um, full-on story and have them match up with each other a little bit more, you know, more better. That's not a way of talking. <laughs> so it could be more better. So the two stories match up a little bit better. I would have... Really? Just cool. Oh, oh is that the fat cop? Vending machine? Stop! Brick. Two o three. 
Three. Can I open 203? He's waving at me. Hmm. He's waving. Hi. Hi. He's not waving anymore. Shit. Got through that real quick. To uh, make a point, <laughs> imagine a situation where instead of, like, say, both Leon and Claire both arrive to the front of the police station, only Claire arrives to the front of the police station, and you have an entire full length sequence of Leon finding his way through the other entrance instead of that abbreviated. <laughs> Put a little bit more effort into it because you don't have to have two versions of his campaign. It doesn't have to happen. <laughs> oh, geez, what was it? Is this cap? I think maybe they changed. Oh, nope, it's still cap. Hey, shotgun shells. I didn't get the shotgun. I forgot to go back and collect it. It's almost like I'm expected to need the shotgun real soon. I wonder what that's about. I always thought that guy would come back, but he never does. I uh, really given a damn, I would have made sure to do as much as I possibly could, just like the first time. As much as I possibly could, go back to the shotgun, this, that, and the other thing. Make sure I got everything that I was going to need before walking down this hallway, because once the tyrant shows up, well, he's going to be there forever. Oh, Claire left us. how effective this, well, I mean, I shot him, and he didn't die. I'm going to suspect this uh, assault rifle or this submachine gun isn't going to be tremendously effective at taking him down. <laughs> Gunshots. There he is. I can do this. Oh my god, die. Fuck. It's gonna take him a second to get through the door. Come on, come on, come on, you big bastard. Oh shit, I gotta shoot him in the face. Oh, put him down. That's my exit. Better get moving. Come on. Oh, 
Here he comes. All right, here we go again. Oh, nope, he's coming around the side. Is he going up there? Oh, he came in through the other door. Oh, nope, he just disappeared. Close by, I know that much. Oh, he's very close by. God damn. This thing will die. <laughs> That's fun. I know this is different. Uh, okay. Ram harp bird. Ah, shit. Look how bad that is. Bird. There we go. Damn it. Damn it. Is there a liquor in here? That's a big yes. <sighs> Mr. X is coming. <laughs> this might be a mistake, but... Down there somewhere. Yep. I don't know if he, he, okay, he didn't know I was up here. That's great. <laughs> what did I get? Okay, I got that. I got this. I gotta double back and go through the way he came. <clears throat> I gotta pick up a couple of items in this room. I'm gonna get to the item, the save room, then I'll end the episode. It'll be a half an hour. Quite a bit of progress if you don't have to worry about ammunition. For, uh, for the tyrant. Well, I gotta put some effort into staying away from the tyrant, but not as much as uh, I would normally. I can just keep putting them down if necessary. Ah, well, there we go. 